as part of a more a strategic initiative within the carrier organization. We are looking at rationalizing our enterprise resource planning uh, applications. Um, and one of the um, initiatives is to reduce the number and the complexity that we have. And in order to meet uh, the future strategies, scalability, cost efficiencies, user tools, scalability of that ERP application, we decided that we were going to move it to a cloud infrastructure. So when we looked at the landscape, um, you know, we had decided that we were going to go to, an or to a cloud infrastructure. We evaluated all the variable um, suppliers of cloud infrastructure. Okay, so we, we compared them all against very strict, um, you know, algorithms, you know, cost, data recovery, scalability, those kind of things. So having done that, um, there was a logical choice for most J.D. Edwards uh, application owners and users. We could have taken that path of least resistance and we could have taken the easy choice and we could have gone that route. But when we looked at all of the variables, all of the attributes that go into not just looking at the, the, the pure cost on day one, but the scalability, the cost on day 365 or whatever, as we looked at all the uh, various providers and looked at the solutions and looked at the cost, what we found was that AWS was not necessarily the most logical choice in terms of the easy path, but it gave us much more flexibility. It gave us much more options that we could plug and play and choose from. And it gave us um, ultimately um, a cost comparison that really came out as, as you know, marginally the best. And you know, that was a win-win for Carrier because it played into our corporate strategy. It played into the financials in terms of, you know, not just initial cost, but longer term cost savings. And it brought us to a point where we decided that AWS really gave us you know, the best option all around, not just in terms of flexibility, in terms of cost, but in terms of scalability, etc. So we went that route. So the other big hitter was to provide really good solutions to the business, to the users, the people that are physically sitting there. They get a lot of new tools, they get a lot of new functionality um, in the application that allows them to really kind of be more efficient, scale up what they're doing, um, you know, and um, allow us to drive, you know, a much more aggressive um, promotion and, and acceleration to cloud and the next generation of solutions. So we've managed to create a, a, a solution now, a, a model where from a cost effective perspective, we've got an ROI on this project that turns around in less than three years, two years to three years, which is a very aggressive um, ROI period. It's allowing us the flexibility, scalability, and strategic alliance with our ERP roadmaps of moving towards uh, things that will allow us to accelerate machine learning, um, provide better solutions and more scalable solutions to the business. I was a reluctant convert, but ultimately I became a convert because you know the AWS op you know options that were out there, the scalability, the, the 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 fact that you can plug and play and move things around, just really made it just so much more um, flexible for the customers.